Hey folks, Glenn Joseph from Progress Management here. Uh, now, if you haven't already, I imagine quite a lot of people have. Um, this video is almost a response to uh, the video that myself and Eddie Dennis recorded at Knuckle Ox Gym earlier on this week. If you haven't seen it already, um, it's on YouTube, our YouTube channel, uh, our, our Facebook page and Twitter. Um, now, I've spoken to uh, since that video was recorded, I've spoken to Jim, I've spoken to John, who's now back in the country, his chapter 63 is now online, On Demand Progress. Um, I've spoken to our legal uh, advisor, uh, JJG, and I've spoken to a doctor friend of mine from up north who's given me more kind of insight and education as to Eddie's injury and the recovery time, which looks like it'll be uh, over four months rather than the uh, original three that Eddie intimated in the other video. So, as per what Eddie's request was to be put back into the Thunder Bastard match, I've spoken to him subsequently and he has said that he'll be there at Chapter 64 regardless anyway. Now, what we've learned recently from Eddie uh, is that he has interjected himself in situations which have made the running of our show very difficult at times. Uh, and he's also made it an unsafe working environment for uh, particularly our crew members, um, as you will see on, on, on chapter 63. So Eddie's been, it's safe to say, in, in deep bother a bunch of times recently and has put us in very, very difficult situations as well. Now, I realized that by putting him in the Thunder Bastard match, we are essentially taking him out of any situation which isn't just him being in a match. And I completely understand Eddie's point about this is his last chance to wrestle before he has his operation on March the 5th and is going to be out for a number of months. Um, there is a huge concern, I think, that he isn't being 100% truthful uh, about his injury. Um, but I am I am finding myself more and more hugely empathetic towards Eddie's situation. I mean, Eddie, not necessarily as a young man, decided to completely change his his life. It wasn't just his, his job by choosing to become, you know, giving up a career that he'd already worked so hard for to become a full-time professional wrestler. And I'm very empathetic towards that. And I realize that Wembley is approaching and that Eddie is fearful that he may not make it to the Wembley card. But he knows that by winning the Thunder Bastard match, he guarantees himself rather a title shot. And that's... I do understand where Eddie's coming from. And we've sought uh, advice from different people. But today... Uh, we sent over Eddie a release form, a waiver, uh, and a contract, essentially protecting ourselves as well, should Eddie not be being as honest as he is about his, his injury, um, but to give him an opportunity, uh, the opportunity that we, you know, we took him out of the match when we knew he was having surgery. But if Eddie signs this, these documents, um, then yeah, we will we will put Eddie Dennis back in the Thunderbusters match at Chapter 64.